Welcome back to the Sports News Analysis YouTube channel, where I'm always breaking down the hot sports topics of the day. My name is Mike. Some breaking college football news late on this Thursday night. Gunnar Keel, the Notre Dame quarterback, according to reports, has informed head coach Brian Kelly that he intends to transfer from Notre Dame. Gunnar Keel, if you remember, was the number one quarterback prospect, according to rivals, from the 2012 class. Uh, he comes to Notre Dame this year, uh, competes with Tommy Reese, Everett Golson, and Andrew Hendricks uh, for the top uh, quarterback job here in camp. Everett Golson obviously wins that battle. Tommy Reese served as the backup this season, and Gunnar Keel was relegated uh, to the practice squad. You know, on the heels of that, and obviously then on the heels of Everett Golson, uh, you know, leading the Irish to an undefeated regular season, you know, I'm sure Gunnar Keel feels, you know, with Golson entering his redshirt sophomore year, that there's just no room for him here in South Bend. Uh, and in his mind, he's on to greener pastures and trying to find you know, his own program and a place where he can go right in and become the starter uh, after sitting out the year uh, as a transfer. If you remember, Keel had a very uh, uh, you know, eventful uh, recruiting process, to say the least. Uh, he originally committed to Indiana, then decommitted, then uh, committed to LSU, and then right before uh, he enrolled early at LSU, decided at the last minute to switch to Notre Dame, and obviously now, you know, a year later, decides Notre Dame's not for him either, and he will transfer. Uh, for the reports are also saying that if Keels changes his mind, you know, Notre Dame will still have a spot for him on their roster. So I guess, you know, Keel could back out of uh, you know what the reports are saying here and come back to Notre Dame. Uh, but usually when a kid makes up his decision to transfer, it's usually not based on a whim. And I expect Keel uh, to be a part of another program uh, this upcoming uh, spring, and then you know obviously redshirt this upcoming season and probably be a starting quarterback wherever he ends up. Uh, I've seen no list as far as you know possible landing spots for Keel. I'm sure that will develop here in the next couple days, and I'll update you on that. But again, Gunnar Keel, the top quarterback from the 2012 uh, high school class, decides to transfer from Notre Dame, uh, no doubt because of what he saw was going to be a lack of playing time for him uh, for years to come here, obviously being a backup um, to Everett Golson, who you know I think was a lot better than people thought this year, was probably a lot better than Gunnar Keel thought he was going to be this year, and probably the Notre Dame coaching staff as well. So let me know what you think of Keel, uh, you know, transferring. I know he's going to get a lot of backlash just because of how dramatic uh, he made his whole recruiting. Uh, you know, he made his whole uh, recruitment as well. Um, so let me know what you think of Gunnar Keel's decision to transfer. Do you have any ideas of where he could end up? Because I haven't heard anything yet. Let me know where you think he could land. Um, do you want him on? You know, do you want him as the quarterback for your team? Let me know. Hit me up in the YouTube comments. Uh, hit me up on Twitter at S News Analysis. And guys, I upload anywhere from three to five sports talk videos a day here on my YouTube channel. So be sure to subscribe, and you'll get all of my videos uploaded directly to your feed. Thanks again for listening, guys, and have a great night.